Greetings. My name is Ian Holloway, and I'm the academic principal investigator of the Southern California HIV AIDS Policy Research Center. Thank you for joining us. I'd like to start by introducing you to the two collaborative California HIV AIDS Policy Research Centers. The California HIV AIDS Policy Research Centers, funded by the California HIV AIDS Research Program, were established in 2007 with the mission to bring the most relevant and timely evidence to bear on HIV AIDS policymaking in order to further California's efforts to develop and maintain efficient, cost-effective, and accessible programs and services to people living with or at risk for acquiring HIV AIDS. Two collaborative HIV AIDS policy research centers comprised of multidisciplinary teams of academic investigators working in partnership with consumers advocates and policymakers conduct policy relevant research that strengthens local, state, and national HIV responses. Our aim is to produce new knowledge that can be applied to improve prevention and care services for affected persons and populations. The Northern California HIV AIDS Policy Research Center is made up of researchers at the University of California, San Francisco, and their community partners at the San Francisco AIDS Foundation. The Southern California HIV AIDS Policy Research Center is made up of researchers at the University of California, Los Angeles, and their community partners at APLA Health and the LA LGBT Center. Together, the work of our research centers focuses on using a rapid response research model. These short-term research projects are designed to quickly address questions that emerge in a dynamic health policy environment. This model involves eliciting suggestions for research topics through consistent contact with our community partners. Together, we evaluate the feasibility of these research suggestions and their potential for meaningful impact. Next, we move toward conducting research using a variety of methods, including primary data collection, secondary data analysis, qualitative case studies, and quantitative synthesis. Finally, we continue to work with our partners to disseminate our research findings through a variety of channels, including social media campaigns, policy briefs, academic papers, community meetings, and briefings with legislators and legislative staff. Once a policy is passed, we continue to evaluate its implementation and impact on people living with HIV and people at risk for acquiring HIV. This ongoing monitoring can inform future rapid response research. In our AIDS 2020 satellite session, you will learn about recent projects designed to support the Ending the Epidemics Initiative in California, as well as projects on PrEP access, HIV decriminalization, HIV and immigration, and HIV service delivery during the COVID-19 pandemic. From our rapid response research, we publish our findings in policy briefs and share our data in a variety of ways. Our publications include policy briefs and research manuscripts, as well as fact sheets and infographics focused on targeted topics. We also share research data through the use of data visualizations. Recent efforts include those focused on mapping COVID-19 cases on background HIV prevalence in Los Angeles County, the epicenter of COVID-19 in California. When the landscape shifts, as we saw happen with the COVID-19 pandemic, we shift too to meet the research-related needs of the moment. Our role is to ensure that proposed policy solutions can be informed by the best research evidence available. A key deliverable related to rapid response research is making sure our work is broadly disseminated and made accessible to the communities we seek to serve. We host and participate in a variety of workshops, seminars, lectures, working groups, webinars, and other events throughout the year. We post upcoming webinars and other events, as well as presentation materials from past events on our website. Next up is a segment on the HIV policy continuum led by Dr. Arlene Leibowitz. The remainder of our pre-recorded satellite session will be featuring two case studies. The first is on HIV decriminalization. The second is on HIV and immigration. Our pre-recorded session also features an interview with one of California's leading legislators on the issue of HIV and health disparities, Senator Scott Weiner.